other versions of the Elden House ghost story that were published in about 1950s and then later in 2000. But unfortunately, when we found these versions, they really didn't stand up to W.T. Stead's. They had other information, um, some of which was, was quite different and really didn't match the newspaper accounts that we had found. So while it was exciting to see more information on the Elden House ghost story, these versions really weren't able to tell us about the true story behind the ghost, just because of the information that differed so much from W. T. Stead's earliest version from 1891. So some of the different versions of the story are that uh, the pocket watch was stopped on 6 o'clock p.m. Um, then there is the story that he was muddy and dripping wet. Um, there is also the story that his horse showed up at Elden House on the night of the ball without him, and that kind of threw everyone into a panic, wondering where, when, and when it could be.